If you're watching Ahsoka, then you've been introduced to Grand Admiral Thrawn, but you might be wondering how exactly Thrawn became the heir to the Empire. Back in the day, Thrawn joined the Imperial Navy as a way to ally his people with the new Galactic Empire and was so efficient and ruthless during his training, he rapidly rose through the ranks, catching the eye of Emperor Palpatine himself who appointed him Grand Admiral. Palpatine even considered Vader and Thrawn to be his two most valuable assets, occasionally sending them together on vital missions for the Empire. Thrawn even exposed another Grand Admiral as a traitor who was secretly sabotaging the new Death Star. After the events of Return of the Jedi, with no Palpatine or Darth Vader, Thrawn is the only Grand Admiral of the Old Guard remaining, which seemingly makes him the true heir to the Empire. 